Hello and welcome back to our FCS South Tournament. Today we've got the North Carolina Central Eagles traveling to take on the Savannah State Tigers in round three, game three. Tigers on offense first. Dunbar looking to throw it. He goes over the middle. Nice catch by Robertson at the 46 yard line. Dunbar to the air again. Rolling. Very patient and hits his wide open man Carter inside the 20 yard line in between two safeties. Dunbar again going to the air. This time he is sacked back at the 20 yard line by Satel. Second and 14 screen pass right side. Wallace with a blocker in front of him and he's in the end zone for the Savannah State Tiger touchdown. And they take the early lead over the North Carolina Central Eagles. Both of these schools are historically black college universities. How did they get here into round three? Savannah State beat North Alabama in round one, 24 to three. And North Carolina Central beat Davidson 42 to 35 in round one. As the Eagles have a nice kick return here past midfield, past the 41 man giving chase. And he's brought down at the 30 yard line. North Carolina Central will then go on into round two to beat Gardner Webb 56 to 36. And Savannah State, of course, had the bye week for round two. Eagles looking to score here to tie this ball game up. They go to the end zone, and it is caught by Hill for six. So they will tie this ball game up at seven apiece early in the first quarter. Just a nice rainbow pass there from the quarterback. Receiver beat the defender by a couple steps. Tigers back on offense, looking to take back the lead. And a nice bullet pass to Wallace up to the 26-yard line. Andre Dunbar, 6 of 7 so far. Tigers do settle for a field goal attempt. Kick is up, and it is good. And now the 10 to 7 lead over the Eagles. Davis, all day to throw. Over the middle, he's picked off by Alexander at the 22-yard line. And we have our first mistake of the game. And a little showboating after the play. First and goal from the five. Walker walks into the end zone for the touchdown. Straight up the middle. Not a defender in sight. 17-7. Eagles looking to answer back. After that interception last drive, he's got a step on the defender. And Clark has it. Breaks a tackle. And nobody's even close to him. That's going to be an easy touchdown for Clark. Tigers back on offense, and they go draw. Dunbar fumbles it, and it is recovered by North Carolina Central, so the Tigers turn the ball over now. Davis looking to tie it or get the lead back. And over the middle, nice catch by Hutchinson, and he drags the defender down to the seven-yard line. Third and goal from the one-yard line. Big fullback up the middle for the touchdown. North Carolina Central Eagles will take the lead, 21-17. Still some time left in the first half as Gibson gets a nice carry to the 39-yard line. Big fullback. Second and 10, 14 seconds to go in the first half. Dunbar's got Robertson wide open past the 40, the 30, and he's taken down at the 28-yard line. That'll set them up with a 45-yard field goal attempt. Kick is up, and it is good. With one second left, Eagles have the lead 21-20 over Savannah State. Second half now, Davis going right side to Hill, who's got the ball, past the 30 and down to the 27 yard line. They will settle for a field goal as well. Kick is up, and he pushes this to the right. It hooked late. Tigers will start on offense at their own 21, but they do hold, and they get the ball at the 11, and there's another fumble for Dunbar, recovered by the Eagles. And there's a holding, that penalty will be declined. Eagles take over. First and goal from the five, and Wiley gets it into the end zone. They have the lead, 28 to 20, here over the Tigers. Play action from Dunbar. Pump fakes, throws it. He's picked off by Henderson, and he's going to return this up to the 36-yard line. But there is a clipping call on the return. That'll drop him back to their own 49. On their offensive drive, here is Davis. Scrambling left side, he's going to take off inside the 20 and down to the 16-yard line. Nice run for Robbie Davis. Just a goal, fullback up the middle. Thompson juking out everyone and goes untouched into the end zone for the touchdown. 
North Carolina Central now has a 35 to 20 lead over the Savannah State Tigers. Well, the Tigers do have the ball here on the 15 yard line. Wallace wide open and that pass was almost intercepted. Instead it's caught for the touchdown and the Tigers will go for two points here with only four minutes left in the ball game. And they are down by nine. Perfect touch on that pass. Here's Wiley for the Eagles getting a carry, and he'll get it up to the 30-yard line. Savannah State did not get the two-point conversion, so they are down nine points with less than four minutes to go. And Wiley on the carry, jukes the safety out, and he's going to walk into the end zone for another North Carolina Central Eagles touchdown. And their lead is now extended 42-26 to with 3.18 to go in the ballgame. Great blocking scheme right there for the offensive line. Fullback did his job, and Wiley goes untouched. 42-26, Andre Dunbar rolling out left side. He's going to take off. Jukes a man out. He's got the first down and more up to the 43-yard line. Tigers have a long way to go to get back into this game with three minutes left. Dunbar goes play action, launches it deep inside the 10, and it is caught by Carter down the two-yard line. First and goal upcoming, what a throw. After a holding call, Dunbar looking to get the yardage back. And in the end zone is Wallace for the touchdown. Savannah State not done yet as they get on the board with 2.43 to go here in the fourth quarter. Going for two points, they're down by 10. And Johnson is wide open in the middle of the end zone for the two point conversion. It's now 42 to 34. Nice pitch on the option to Wiley. Spins, breaks a tackle in the open field, past midfield, and an ankle tackle down at the 48-yard line. Third and six, Tigers need to stop, and they get it. Eagles went for the halfback direct snap, and that was a high snap, and it just destroyed the momentum of the play. Andre Dunbar looking to score here. He's got Wallace out of bounds at the 30-yard line with 103 to go in the game. They're down eight. Need a touchdown and a two-point conversion. To tie it up. Dunbar is sacked back at the 40-yard line. Eagles defense just bringing the pressure. 45 seconds to go. Dunbar pressured again. And he's going to take off. That's the 30 and out of bounds at the 28-yard line. And there is a face mask. Just a five-yarder. That'll make it second and four. And they'll give it off to Walker. They're going to keep it on the ground here up to the 15-yard line with 35 seconds left. Now 11 seconds to go in the game. Dunbar, quick pass to Nolan, and he's going to walk into the end zone with six seconds to go, but we need a two-point conversion here for the Tigers to tie it up. Two points to tie. If they don't get it, they will most likely lose this ball game. Dunbar is picked off inside the five, and they will have to attempt an onside kick now with just six seconds to go. They're down two points after a great touchdown drive. And the onside kick attempt from Rodgers. It's got a nice bounce on it, and it is touched by an eagle and recovered by the Tigers with five seconds to go in the ball game. And they have to get one quick play to get in field goal range here. A rare onside kick recovery. Dunbar is gonna go to the air. There's not enough time for another play, and it's caught by Robertson in the open field, and he's gonna go all the way the Tigers are going to walk out of here with a walk-off touchdown pass. 58-yard touchdown bomb to Robertson from Andre Dunbar. What an unreal finish to this game. Great comeback by the Tigers. That was all heart there in the fourth quarter. Let me know what you guys thought of this ball game. I'll let you guys take a look at the stats. And that was just insane. One of the best finishes we've seen in these two tournaments that we've had for the FCS. Savannah State advances and will take on the winner of our next ball game, which is the Charleston Southern Buccaneers taking on the Jacksonville Dolphins in round three, game four. That one will be out tomorrow, so stay tuned, guys. I will see you then. Take it easy, guys.